Hello again, my name is Gabe Zollner. This is the 17th of January, 2019. I posted a couple of videos this morning. One was titled, Rudy Giuliani has to be held accountable re-9-11. And the most recent video that I posted was Timothy McVeigh, Murray Building Explosion, Patsy. And I attached two links. One of those links is a news report and the other is a series of photographs which you can clearly see that the building was blown from the inside out, not the outside in. But what some of you may or may not know is getting into a federal building with any kind of device, never mind three massive bombs. You see this? This is a little pocket knife, right? That's what that is. You see the, you see the blade on it? All right, so like, that's on my key ring. I was going to court, and there's a federal building, and I had this. They made me take this off and put it back in my vehicle. I couldn't go into a federal building with that little pocket knife. And now, so what this says very clearly is that the Murray building was taken down by our government. They're the only ones that had access to the building and to those kinds of ordinances. Somebody brought in three large bombs. You heard what the reporter said. The reporter said that Billy Bob Clinton is sending special agents to investigate the bombs. Well, Billy Bob Clinton is sending agents to investigate the bombs, which means that, again, there were bombs. Witnesses saw explosive teams driving with their vehicles to pick up these unexploded ordinances. I don't know how much more proof people need. You've heard me say this, we need another grand jury investigation. There's one that's going to take place on 9-11. We need one on the Murray building for the reasons that are obvious in this attached link video. I don't make the news, folks. I just look at the pieces of the puzzle. And they paint a frightening picture. Everything goes back to our government. Have you noticed all of the events that have taken place right after or prior to a drill? Sandy Hook was a drill. Boston Marathon bombing, there was a drill. Parkland school shooting, there was a drill. It couldn't be any clearer than it is. But here's the frightening reality. Who are you going to go to? If our government is behind these events, and I believe that they are, the McCallum memo shows why Japanese attacked Pearl Harbor. Roosevelt knew they were going to attack. That's why, again, he moved out the aircraft carriers. They needed those. They didn't care about the Nevada and the Arizona rusted out battleships. They didn't care about the 2,500 men. They didn't care about the 3,000 innocent people that died at the Twin Towers. Are you sort of getting the picture? They didn't care of the hundreds of people that died in the Murray Building takedown. They don't care, folks. We're expendable. They're not. But they need to be. Again, who are you going to go to? Hmm? There's no one to go to. But you know what? I'd rather know the truth than not know the truth. Wouldn't you? Listen to the video. Do your own research. You'll come to the same conclusions that I have. They needed to have explosive experts go in 
And they would have determined what we already all know. McVeigh was a patsy. Plain and simple. No different than Nicholas Cruz. A patsy. An MK Ultra graduate. That's sort of what I think. You might want to pass this along to like-minded friends. You might want to repost in your social media accounts. You might want to send a copy to President Trump. Ask him, what the hell is he waiting for? They need to convene. Grand jury. And you know why, don't you?